Two years ago, Ingenuity proved that we could do the impossible. We can fly on Mars. Let's talk about what's next. Here at the Surface Robotics Lab, testing is being done on future Mars helicopters. Teddy Sanatos is here with us today to talk about the helicopter that started it all, Ingenuity. Teddy, what's the latest? Ingenuity is doing great. Our baby is still flying on the surface of Mars. After two Earth years, one Mars year of total flight, racked up 10 kilometers or 6.2 miles of total distance flown. Our rotor system, our little cell phone processor on board, our off-the-shelf lithium-ion batteries are all doing fantastic. One area that we're looking very closely at is our solar panel. You can imagine after two years of flying on the surface of Mars, you'll get some dust on top. But we still have ample margin and ample energy to keep up our flight operations and the extended mission of continue to scout and push the flight envelope of what's possible. The testing being done in this room is part of the next helicopter mission to Mars called the Sample Recovery Helicopters. The goal is to be a backup to get these samples back to Earth. Put simply, Perseverance collects the sample tubes. The sample return lander will retrieve those samples directly from Perseverance. And then there's a rocket inside of that lander that's actually going to send those samples back to Earth. As a backup to getting those sample tubes from Mars back to the lander, we're designing the next generation of helicopters to not only be able to pick up and carry a sample tube, but also drive around on the surface. Are there any other ways Ingenuity is influencing future Mars exploration? We're looking at a research concept called Mars Science Helicopter. It's a hexacopter, so six rotors in a ring around a central structure. It's about the size of the rover, and you can imagine in the future, you will have fleets of these Mars Science Helicopters flying around, bringing important payloads to areas of Mars that we've never been able to access before. What's next for Ingenuity? So we're trying to fly faster, trying to fly higher. We've added new flight software capabilities. We can now detect landing sites airborne. Those sorts of winds are coming from the surface of Mars directly into the design of the new sample recovery helicopters. And she's done a fantastic job. Surpassed any sort of metric of success that anyone on the team could have ever imagined for this little tiny four pound spacecraft. To get the latest updates on Ingenuity, follow at NASA JPL and at NASA Mars on social media, or take a deeper dive on the mission websites at mars.nasa.gov. <laughs>